You're watching Chris 6 News Sunrise. You certainly are, and it's Thursday morning. Time now is 533. Well, today in the Coastal Bend, the Texas General Land Office is celebrating the completion of two affordable rental housing complexes with a ribbon cutting ceremony. This is a bounce back from 2017's Hurricane Harvey. The damage is now gone and new homes are in. This morning, Sunrise reporter Victoria Bandarama has more on what this means for locals. Good morning. Good morning and the housing complexes the GLO worked to complete are in some of our smaller communities like Robstown and Refugio. And while it's been several months since the apartments welcomed back their residents, the public couldn't get an inside look until now. We replaced everything in the apartment. Cabinets, stove, icebox, tub, shower, floors, rebuilt the closets. A complete makeover. That's how the people who live at the Refugio Elderly Housing Apartments describe the work done by the GLO. It had been here for 27 years. 27, 20. So summer. they were just remodeling and yeah. needed it. The Texas General Land Office says 36 apartment homes saw major changes, including some at the Sierra Royal Apartments in Robstown. We had many apartment complexes in that area that were uh, significantly damaged or even destroyed. Um, because the uh, swarm first hit and made landfall in that area. That storm she's talking about is Hurricane Harvey. X says by using $588 million in funds from the Community Development Block Grant for Disaster Recovery, the GLO was able to help rehabilitate, reconstruct, and construct some houses. And we want folks to know that not only were those dollars allocated and awarded to projects, those projects are becoming, uh, are now complete. X says the GLO used the funding to help improve 80 multifamily rental housing that were damaged or destroyed in 48 surrounding counties. Right now, 40 have been completed and 40 others are still under construction, including in Rockport. We are building a high quality, energy efficient, uh, more resilient home that will stand against the next storm. And people living at the Refugio Elderly Housing Apartments say this was important to them. It turned out real well. I, I'm very happy. I love Refurio. Eck tells me it's important to the Texas General Land Office to provide adequate and affordable housing in these rural areas because we need our workforce members to stay here in the coastal bend. The ribbon cutting ceremony will be happening this morning at 10 a.m. at the Sierra Royal Apartments and later at the Refurio Elderly Housing Apartments at 1 p.m. You can find more information on our website, KRISTV.com. Reporting in the studio, Victoria Balderrama, Chris 6 Sunrise. So glad they're back home. Good for them. And you can see the smiles on their faces. I know, they, yeah. they were happy to be back too. And they're proud. Let's oh, go.